some of the Quebec influencers who were aboard the now infamous chartered flight from Montreal to Mexico December 30th when they were seen on social media not wearing masks on the flight with no distancing, dancing in the aisle and on seats, bottles of alcohol passed around the plane and some even smoking an electronic cigarette have now returned to Montreal. According to information from TVA Nouvelle, about 15 people managed to take an Air Canada flight back, arriving late Wednesday night. Reports say at least one of the passengers was met and escorted by border agents soon after arrival at Trudeau Airport. Other passengers were also questioned by authorities on site and refused to speak to journalists on location. Airlines like Air Canada, Air Transat and Sunwing, the carrier of the Montreal-Mexico flight, had all come out saying they were banning the disruptive passengers from their flights. James William Awad, who operates 111 Private Club, the group that organized the flight, said in an online statement Thursday that he took several steps to ensure the safety of all individuals involved, including chartering a private aircraft, taking private transportation and having COVID-19 tests done before departing Canada. Awad said he also met with Sunwing Thursday morning to work towards getting the entire group back home, but they allegedly imposed a list of conditions, including that Awad pay for a security manager and three security guards to assist them on the flight back to Canada. Other restrictions reportedly imposed by Sunwing, properly wearing face masks at all times, no in-flight meal, proof of valid PCR tests, all carry-on items including phones stored in the plane's hold, no alcohol and no standing in the plane's aisle. In his statement, Awad wrote, I agreed to every demand, including multiple in-flight guardians. I assured them every measure would be followed, but we couldn't conclude an agreement because Sunwing refused to provide meals to the group for a five-hour flight. This was my first travel event. I have significantly learned and I'm still learning from this experience and that he's working tirelessly to get everyone back home safely. On Wednesday, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau called the party on the plane a slap in the face, ensuring Transport Canada will investigate the incident and follow up. The federal government says they're in contact with Sunwing regarding the flight and if they find non-compliance with regulations, passengers could be fined up to $5,000. In Montreal, Alicia Rubertucci, City News.